Hi everyone, it's Don from Crux Terminatus with the Macarius Vanquisher uh, from Forge World. Uh, I've gone for an urban camo sort of blue grey scheme on this one, so starting off with my favourite base coat of the moment, which is Sombre Grey from Vallejo uh, Model Air, and then I'm using um, Stone Grey um, to put some camouflage stripes on it. And um, although they look quite shiny there, it's actually obviously very matte, it's just the studio lights are, are very, very bright. So that's uh, the sort of gist of it, um, standard sort of camouflage lines, and I just make sure that all the lines match up uh, going over the body uh, of the tank and put some on the turret that work uh, at 90 degrees left and right and straight ahead as well. So that's uh, you have to think quite carefully about that but uh, you get used to it if you're painting tanks uh, for quite a while so once uh, once I've done that it's basically straight on to the rest of the details I mean that's ultimately 90% of the um, the paint job done what I decided to do is I put um, a wolf grey lining to the camouflage stripes um, because I, I just think it, it it makes it look just a wee bit more different um, and different is, is what I'm, I'm going for. I never try and paint models the, the same as everyone else. Um, and I think you just when when this is all weathered up, those lines just look perfect. Um, and at the moment, they, you must be thinking, well, why has he done that? Well, you'll see in a minute. Uh, I used track primer, uh, which you know is just brilliant for for tracks, as the name suggests. Funny that. And then after that. Um, I used some uh, rust primer as well to paint the exhaust stacks and the spare link tracks uh, at the back as well. So what I do now is I put on uh, some gloss varnish, uh, it makes it all nice and shiny uh, because I'm just about to do an oil wash which uh, is um, Van Dyke brown which is the oil colour. But this is interesting, this is a, a custom printed decal. As you can see, I'm very proud of it. It's tiny. It's like a bomber nose art from the, the 1940s, but this is me just basically trying to use it for the very first time. And you'll see the results in a second. It actually worked quite well, so, you know, shocker, really. Uh, I'll be doing more of that later on in the future. And this is me just adding the weathering powders um, to, the, to the model. And then once it's all done and dusted, um, I spray it with matte varnish to take the shine off it. Uh, and it also obviously secures um, the pigment uh, to the tank as well. So, you know, people said, oh, go and do a tank that's absolutely filthy, you know, absolutely filthy, it's just a big pile of mud. Well, to be honest, yeah, not in a model like this because they're so expensive. Um, I'm not going to hide it uh, behind layers and layers of mud. So I still want you to be able to see uh, what this is. So um, this is what it's... Um, it's looking like uh, sitting on my shelf at the moment. Uh, as I say, I, I, I set myself the challenge of the three models uh, over the week I had off, and that's me completing the three of them. Uh, it's, it still looks a bit shiny there, but uh, trust me, it's, it's because we're under really, really powerful light. Uh, it's actually quite matte. Um, there's that decal uh, on the turret. You'll see this sunshine girl. Um, yeah. Uh, that works ridiculously well actually. Uh, I've, I've never used custom printed decals before uh, so I'll be using them again uh, going forward. And you know everything else is just uh, chrome um, and uh, tank brown on the sort of sharp edges and corners. I like the fact that there's different colours of dust uh, like it's been going through uh, like buildings and, and rubble and, and stuff like that, like that, like the blue glow on the, the lights as well. Um, but you've got to love those two battle cannons, right? I mean, that's why you would buy one of these things. Absolutely immense. So, loved it. And um, so, that's the three models all together, all complete. Uh, never thought I would ever do that in a million years, but I had a week off work and that is them complete so you, if you want to see the other videos they're all out there thanks very much if you could leave me a comment i'd really appreciate it and if you could subscribe as well that'd be grand cheers bye, -bye.